All right, more more Super Smash Bros. action. I'm still I'm recording again. That's that's great. All right, time to choose. Uh, yeah, I'll use I'll use you. I like using you. You're my you're not my favorite necessarily, but yeah, good times with him. Oh dang, son. All right, here we oh go. yeah, look at that! Since it's custom, I have different uh, I have different move sets. I totally forgot about that. Oh, DHDA. <laughs> no, my least favorite character. Ah, Fire Fang, you failed me. Well, that didn't, so I'm happy for that. Yeah! You already have over 100 damage, that's insane. Yeah, that kind of dog is super weak. Yo, yeah, don't do it! Oh no! That kind of dog is very technical though, so I can pull he... off a lot of interesting combos. Ouch. Yeah, he, he is a long range fighter, isn't he? Yeah. Yeah. But it's so weird how his final smash is short range. Yowp! <laughs> Your exploding can, I eat it. I've even been able to see people online who can multitask, like, the can and fight at the same time. I'm like, people multitask like that. Yeah, I've seen people do it too, it's insane. Ouch! That hurts, that really hurts. Get out of here, can. Useless. Yeah! Oh no, no, don't do it! <laughs> Dang, son! Get a rock chunk to the face! Goodbye! It was nice knowing you, feller! You done tried! No, wrong place! No! Hey, give her! No, wait, no, wrong! Oh, whoa, whoa. oh, okay. Ouch! That really hurt, man! No, oh, no! Go! Go Charizard! You're Charizard for a reason! Oh, you done! Ouch! No! Can't let you do that, sir! Frisbee! God damn it, no! The Frisbee thwarted my plans! Get out of here! Good, really good! Come into the fight. Come into the fire fang. Ouch, sombrero man. Why would you do this to me? No! I'm completely open. So is Alec doesn't like cards are hurt. Oh. No, goddammit, no! Don't, don't do it. Oh, that was scary. Oh, no. Oh, there we go. So scary. Ah, nice try, mate. Go! Oh man, I don't know how I'm still alive. I don't know how I'm still alive. <laughs> After this, you won't be. Oh no, goodbye. Before gone. <laughs> I'll see. We, we should see if anyone else wants to join. Uh, possibly. Yeah. So far, though. So far, it's pretty even. Do you online or anything? Uh, no, I don't think so. All right, let's. I sent out a tweet and all that, so maybe someone. Wait. Ah. Robin. Can use my favorite Robin. Red-haired Robin. Cause she's favorite a favorite Robin. I do like bluebirds, though. <laughs> I like red-haired Robin. I usually just use default costume because I'm boring. <laughs> it's cause Unless I'm this character, then I change to orange. It's cause red hair, you know? Yeah. It's my weakness. This character I think. Oh, Shulk. Ouch. It really hurt. Plus, I just got Xenoblade yesterday, so. Oh, how is it? I haven't tried it yet. 
last night I was busy playing Codename Steam as well. How is that game? Codename Steam is interesting, to say the least. Does it give RTS games or. No, it's not really a real time strategy, is it? It's, it's, uh, it's it... kind of like Valkyria Chronicles, the way it plays. Oh. But it, it's oh. super hard. Luckily, there's no permadeath, like a fire emblem, but. Oh, thank god, I hate that. It, or Valkyria Chronicles. Does that have permadeath? Well, it does if you don't if you don't um rescue your rescue your guy in either three moves or the enemy gets to him. Uh, then Ben's dead. Then. It's been forever since I played that area. Man, I'm stuck on this one level and it's really pissing me off. Against that giant tank, and I'm just like, please, I just want to kill it. Don't make it makes things so hard. Haha! -ha! I saw that coming. But now, one thing about Code Name Steam is it has unrelenting difficulty. Oh and boy. Fire emblem emotes are essentially useless. Oh. Because I put Marth in the game, and Marth is the sword welder, as you well know. Oh yeah. And this is a game where every character has guns. Is it? Is Robin in that game or no? Robin is in the game, but I don't have a Robin who can test it. Well, maybe he or she could use, you know. It's the he Robin. Oh, okay. Well, do you think they'll do you think they'll give out a do you think they'll give out um a female Robin or now? Uh, I don't think they will. So I would love a female Robin. If they do, it'd probably be a super limited thing. Yeah. And knowing female amiibos, Mario the Plumber would probably scalp as many as he can. Snaffle. Wait, that's the that's the scalper? Oh, yeah. that's one of them? Uh, there's more than you can put. The guy who bought 400 uh, Rosalina Rumors. Jesus, what is wrong with some people, man? Yeah, he just got some big inheritance from his family after someone passed away. And, and that's what he's all in Amiibos. Jesus. See, that kind of scum shouldn't be allowed to live, you feel? Like, I hate. I like, hate I scalpers. Don't know which death on him, but hey, come on, let some get points. Some people are just, like, the worst kind of people. Don't, they do not, dis like, and is it possible to flag them or anything, or no? No. Nintendo's aware of what he's doing, and Nintendo's not happy, but he's not breaking any laws, they can't do anything. Because he, he technically bought it. He, he bought them. Yeah. He went to the store, made money, and he bought them. Damn it. Still, more people should be aware of what he's doing so he doesn't get, you know? Then, then he'd probably stop, but people are unaware of what he's doing. Oh, he's claiming that people are bullying him. So, he deserves it. Yeah. Like... He went on YouTube and made a video about how he feels like he's being bullied. Well, he deserves what he gets, because he's yeah. kind of a dick. Oh no, invincibility! I forgot about that! No! Take this art! He's take... reasoning for why uh, so many of you was stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Well, what's his reason? Uh, he thinks that if he buys all the amiibos of characters that he doesn't like, and Nintendo will realize the error of their ways and go back to the way they used to do things. He is dumb. He does realize that they're a company, and a lot of people want what they have, so one person is not going to make a difference. Thanks. If I if I buy every Rosalina, every Lucina, every Zero Two Samus, and every Palutena, then Nintendo will stop making. Characters. That's his theory. He is as dumb as he. Wow, that's funny. He actually believes that's gonna happen. Yeah, he thinks so. Jeez, he is pretty daft he does, then. He also pulled a total rant from the Fire Emblem trailer, saying he doesn't want the Japanese crap in his Nintendo, ah! which is totally ironic. But uh. <laughs> oh man, he is so dumb. I hope he gets what's coming to him. Yeah. I just he wait for four chances out of or something. Cause yeah, that that guy's a dick in all forms. I really hope he doesn't, you know, if he doesn't want Fire Emblem, if ignore it like any normal person. Yeah. Don't. Oh, you took that to our fire, our 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 thunder. That's what it is. But yeah, if he doesn't like it, ignore it. It's simple like that. You're not gonna change anything. There's still, it's a dip. It's. I don't even have anything to say about that guy, you know, at this point. And he's making a shit ton of money, too. Yeah, cause... But he's going on eBay and he's selling all the amiibos for triple 
price. So, okay, we, we, so, someone has to make it aware that he's very much ripping people off. People are still paying the prices because they just want the Amiibos and they're patient. Man, that's... Because there are people who pay $100, $200 for Amiibos. Just one Amiibo. Okay, that's... I'm like, people, you need to stop. You do! Like, no one me- no- Nintendo's gonna smart enough. Be patient. No! Oh my god, I'm so lucky okay. that missed. Oh, I'm so lucky. No, no! Art fired! You're but gone! sitting here on my mantle, I'm looking at it right now. I have gold Mario Amiibo. Huh. And gold Marios are selling for 100 200 on eBay. And it's like, I paid $12 for this thing. Nice! Like, I'm willing to sell it a friend of mine for 30 because I have another one. Yeah. Uh, 30 that seems like a fair price, does it not? It does, it's completely fair in all aspects. It's for what I did, and it gives me a little bit of the gas money that I went to go get the thing. Yeah, but selling for over a hundred dollars is not worth it. No part of it is worth it. Yeah. That guy is scum. Yeah, because I go on eBay every day, it's like, oh, Captain Falcon, seventy dollars. Oh, Pit, eighty dollars. Oh look, a pre-order. A pre-order! Not even the full amiibo yet. Fifty dollars. Jeez. That is dumb. That is I don't even yes. know what to say, you know? Yeah. Just I just can't wait for Nintendo to smart this thing up. Yeah. I just wanna fill up these empty slots on my amiibo shells and have a few toys that I can appreciate. I mean, I have Luigi and Zelda, and I'm kind of content with that. The only ones I want now are the split, the Inkling. Yeah. Um, let's see. I want the Inkling, Ike, Lucina, <clears throat> uh, Robin, and ah, uh... oh, that's kind of it. If they ever yeah, make a Mewtwo the one, then I want that one. Which one? All the Fire Emblem ones. Yeah. Because again, that dick. Lucina won't be too hard, but I hope not, because Lucina's the one I want most. I know, of, of all of them, because I just love Lucina to death. Yeah, Lucina's gonna be a really hard one to get. Yeah, but, you know, I'm, I'm willing to bide my time. Eventually, you know, you'll get him. Especially for us from fucking Canada, Jigglypuff is one of the hardest ones to get. Yeah. And because Jigglypuff's hard is elusive, guess what we don't have in Canada anymore? Mm, yeah, no target. And it sucks, they just decide to move, and I'm like, come on, really? Target just couldn't keep their promises that they made to the Canadian market. No, obviously not. And then Future Shop closed. Yeah, I know, that's, that's what I'm really... I really don't like that that happened. Yeah, your area, do you have a Future Shop or a Best Buy? For both? Yeah, I have both. Yeah, we have both in Belleville, too. They're just down the road from each other. And now, once the huge empty parking lot. Yeah. And, well, Best Buy does own Future Shop, so I mean. Yeah, they do, but. They're kind of getting just... rid of their own competition. Yeah. But it's still, Future Shop was the better one. Yeah. I went to both, because sometimes one would have fields, the other doesn't. Yeah. Sometimes Future Shop would have something, sometimes Best Buy would have something. But if men have the choice, and they're both going to the same person's pocket anyway. Yeah, exactly. In the end. And it plus jobs, you feel? Yeah, that's what I feel sad for. Is, uh, I have a few friends who are at the shop, and they just went to work on whatever Saturday it was. It's like, oh, building clothes. They were pulled that day. That's, that's a dick move by Best Buy, for sure. Yeah. Like, give them a week notice or something. Don't just open clothes. Yeah. Go home. That's real. Oh man, that's uh, that's a really bad. That's a really sad day in Canadian news, eh? Yeah. Ah, go oh no! <laughs> yep. Oh my god, I did not see that coming. Oh, there you go. I can hear feedback now, though. Oh well. This this has become more of an informative video than uh, a <laughs> gameplay one. Which is funny. Oh no, there you go. Gameplay news, just gameplay in the background. Yeah, that's well, that's how some gameplay news does it, right? Yeah, that's how uh, you're even with us a lot. Oh man, love that guy. 
Oh, don't do it. There you go. I blocked that execution button. I still haven't died once. This is. What? I haven't died. Oh, there. No, I still haven't died once. This is insane. Oh, there we go. No, still not. Okay. We. Oh no. Oh, there we go. Woo. That was that was intense. No, no, no. Gah! I was totally falling by the mind. Leave me alone. <laughs> Thought I might as well die once. Oh man. My favorite. In terms of in terms of characters, Lucina's still my favorite. She's just she just yells adorable. Mm -hmm. I like the attention to detail on a lot of the characters, Lucina especially. Yeah. With their armor, their clothing. Like, you can see the fabric on. I know it's clothing. it's so lovely. It's perfect. All right, who should I be next? Maybe someone I don't usually fight with. So. Uh, who do I not? Like my fight? girlfriend really appreciates it because she's cosplay. She's super into cosplay. She looks at materials and shit all the time. And she looks at the game and says, I know what material that is. I'm like, Era, I'm trying to play a game. <laughs> Don't ruin my video game with your real life moment. <laughs> exactly. Don't do it. Alright, what else can we talk about, though? Anything that's. Anything. Any other news? Because since this has become more of informative than gameplay. Well, there's the Ryu and Roy stuff. Yeah! The whole extra hidden file thing. Yeah, I managed to listen to the files. Three, and. Two, oh, it's a state epic! Oh, hey, look at that! <laughs> Nest fight! But yeah. I want a custom save that bad. Tell, us, tell us about that, because I don't really know much about that at, at the moment. Well, all I know about it is I went on Reddit this morning and I just saw this thing and it was uh, someone was sent to the update files and they found these four sound clips. Sound clips were entitled SF2 Ryu, uh, W Ryu, uh, W Lucas, and W Roy. W Lucas was uh, the Earthbound victory theme, W Roy was the Fire Emblem victory theme. Ooh, that would be cool. Ryu, what? That would have been cool, the Fire Emblem theme. Yeah. It's the same one that Nance, Rob, or not Nance, that Rob and Lucina and Marth have when they win. Oh. It's the same victory theme. That's cool. And, uh, the for, uh, Ryu was the theme you get when you win a battle in Street Fighter 2. Oh, dang. And then SF2 Ryu was actually Ryu's theme song in Street Fighter 2. Oh, man. See, that's cool. I hope that's true. I don't think was, neither of those were remixed. They were just the original versions. Oh, that is awesome. So I hope so, this I hope it's, you know, actual fi oh my god. Yeah. Could be just a fucking throw off people, but But I hope not. That'd be awesome to have Ryu. Yeah. Go! Oh no! I failed. Yeah, ah. Ryu would be kinda cool. Combo, real combo and stuff. Oh man, Hadouken. Like, imagine having to input like all the directions and stuff like you would in Street Fighter. Oh, that. See, I would not be good with Ryu then, because I'm really, I'm really bad with uh, Street Fighter, because the, all the combos. Whereas and stuff. I am amazing at Street Fighter. I'm so bad at Street Fighter. It's, it's pretty. Oh my, there I go. Yeah, Street Fighter for me is just not a thing. I, I tried uh, to. I tried 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 to. Oh, how, how is the Mugen going along anyway? You you did work on one for a while. Uh, it's been done, but it refuses to be uploaded to the internet. Oh. I have uploaded it four times, and it's like, nope, don't want to do this. And the internet. Okay, that is, that is unfortunate, because I've, I've been wanting to play that. Because you, yeah, you have a lot of characters on your roster, don't you? Uh, like 200 plus. Jeez, that's insane. It's characters ranging from most video game genres, uh, a lot of anime, a lot of cartoons, a couple of real life fighters. Oh, really? Yeah. No. It's one character in the game is Michael Jackson. Oh my god! Uh, Shaquille O'Neal. Uh, who's the game? The younger video gamer in the game. Oh, really? That's awesome. Ouch. With no one's consent, of course, because it's a fan game. Well, yeah, obviously, that's the only way to do it. Man, I'm getting juggled so hard right now. Yeah, I love Mugen. Yeah, because I didn't make any of it, I just put it all together. Yeah. I mean, I kind of tried to make one, and it, it was good. 
but because I helped the assistant of Andrew Video Game Nerd, I did his sound files. Oh. Uh, I helped with some of the coding for Light Yagami and Death Note. He's in the game. Huh, that's cool. And I made three of the stages that are in the game. Like, just, just from scratch? Uh, yeah. Wow. Yeah, one of the stages is the locker room. Uh, one of the stages is, uh, high school hallway, which is my high school, actually. Huh. My old high school, when I'm in college. Yeah. And last stage is called Void. It is an all-white area with nothing but the characters and their shadows. Ah, that's cool. Room. Ah, so dude! You might counter that by making a stage called the Spatial Highway. And Spatial Highway is... No, wait, no, I do not want to go down there. No! Underground. That's cool. Let's do this. Ha, ah, look, 69, ho. Oh, inappropriate joke. Not anymore. Ah. No, I failed. I failed. The per perfect opportunities to hit you, and I failed them. Oh, that's funny. I have yet to make... I like the background of this, though. Yeah, this is, uh, the first custom stage I made, and I just really like Namco games growing up. So I gave it all the Namco themes. That is so cool. I like the ship, though. It kinda reminds me of Halo. A little, yeah. Haha, <laughs> we did it. I did it. Hey, you're kidding. Alright, so yeah, I guess that goes for... I guess this, since this become informative, that's the game news and stuff. So yeah, I'll just, I'll end the recording here. Okay. Yep. Yeah.